my pleasure to welcome the CEO of a hot company, Zoho, Sridhar Vembu, who is a top 50 winner. Sridhar, welcome. Oh, I'm happy to be here. Thank you. Um, I said to the other peers who have been the award winners, that is very humbling for all of us here at Team Tycoon to see such inspiring entrepreneurs taking the lead in these challenging times and becoming bold entrepreneurs. Uh, so thank you very much for participating in the first place. Wanted to ask you uh, about your space and the constraints you feel in these challenging times. Can you elaborate on that? Yeah. So uh, first to give a little background of Zoho. We are actually a software as service uh, a company providing a full suite of applications from the office productivity, email calendaring, CRM, project management, all of this with a particular focus on small and medium businesses and also you know, now increasingly an enterprise market. So that's what Zoho is about. You can check us out at zoho.com. And what we have actually, we are an unusual company in the sense we it's uh, bootstrapped. We never took any outside funding. And the parent of Zoho, Advanet, that has been around 12 years. It's profitable. And we grew from our humble roots. And every you know few years, we expanded and expanded and expanded. Now Zoho is our one of our biggest divisions now. Okay. Um, do you see any particular challenge, either in the vertical or the space you're in, or as an entrepreneur for the company in the foreseeable future? And how do you think you can yeah, overcome uh, that? Particularly the smaller companies, what you face is how do you get the word out? So how does people, how do people know you? And for us, we have actually, you know, the internet is the medium through which we spread all the, spread the word, and that has been quite successful for us. And we have about 1.6 million users registered in Zoho, and it's growing very rapidly. So and that is the first challenge, how do you get the word out? And for us, our strength is engineering. We have a really strong team in India building our product, and that has been our biggest asset. And we continue to build on it, and we continue to build products and update our current products at a rapid pace. That is how we actually face the competition today. You know, I was asking uh, our keynote this morning, Tony Shea. Uh, he's a second generation Asian American. And so when I come here, um, I see less of a challenge in terms of assimilation into the culture. And you are a bright young entrepreneur and there are many other peers like you who come. Um, do you see challenges differently, if at all, as an entrepreneur? Uh, compared to the second generation Asian Americans here? Uh, I cannot really speak too much about what the second generation feels like, but I can say that uh, particularly here in Silicon Valley, because of so much diversity, you almost feel at home. It's, uh, and, and we Indians are also used to the diversity back home, so it's not so different. I mean, in, in, in a way, it's very similar in the sense that our company in Chennai has you know, very, many different people of uh, religious faith, language, ethnicity, all of that. And the same thing is applicable here. So in a way, you know, being Indian, you are already actually in a unity and diversity, as we say in India. And it's the same thing here. So in that sense, it is not uh, such a big challenge. Uh, but you know, it's, uh, you still have to make some adjustments in the way, specific ways we operate, and that, that we have had to do. Mm -hmm. um, this was the first time in our 16-year history as the world's largest conference, as you know, that we instituted these awards. Um, what did it mean for you to be among the top 50? Oh, I'm really, it's, uh, I'm really fortunate to be in the top 50 and, uh, and I saw the quality of the other companies, it's really good. And I'm really proud to get this from Thai because you know, obviously I'm Indian and this is so, you know, it's such an honor to receive it from Thai. So okay. I'm really excited. And finally, how was the experience uh, in our 16th year at the largest conference? And this is really an amazing event. I mean, and, and particularly in this time, filling everything and, and you know, trade shows are declining but this event is you know going strength to strength and so many people and it's just unbelievable okay. how we have done it so it's a pleasure to have you thank you very much yeah. thank you